you, Kahir. Look, um, I would like to raise um, a harrowing story that was highlighted on the Mail on Sunday over the weekend. Um, I think it was missed out on due to the election frenzy, and it, it relates to um, it, a mass grave in Shoom County, Galway. This is well known by locals in the area uh, for remains of approximately 80, 800 children, citizens of Ireland, um, were buried. Many of these children were born outside wedlock. They were thrown lifeless into a pit with a sack to cover them. Uh, these children were, were buried coffinless in a disused water or septic tank on the grounds of the former Bon Secours home for unmarried mothers in Tume, an institution which operated until 1961. These children were often no more than babies. The cause of their, their death, where it can be ascertained, uh, was listed as being due to malnutrition, convulsions and pneumonia. The mortality rate of these children is estimated to be akin to those of the 17th century. The site has no memorial and there is reported to be a Garda investigation into missing death cer certificates and it's now surrounded by a housing estate and it's nothing more than a bare patch of ground which was lovingly attended to by a local man and his wife and he has recently uh, passed away. The local community in Tume are endeavouring to raise funds for the erection of a monument and I would ask the leader to raise the matter with the relevant minister so that at the very least the state might provide an acknowledgement of these citizens, these 800 babies, their existence.